So this video is not fun. I recently got a haircut, as in like two days ago, and as you can see by the title, or... I'm not happy with it! So then what else would I do besides go and spend some money on stuff that will make me feel better about myself? I have really deep issues. So today we are going to spend money that I don't have on stuff that I really don't need. My self-esteem is below zero thanks to this lady that does not know how to follow directions. I'm sorry if I'm sounding bratty, but like, that's a tea, sis. So here's the story. Let me tell you about my bad haircut. Okay. My freaking me, of course. There I was, on Monday, feeling like jizz. I hated everything about me. Oh, what a great way to improve myself if I go get a haircut. Well, that was my first mistake. I should have just shut my ass up and stayed home. But anyways, regardless, there I was, driving to the haircut place after I had some Chick-fil-A. Life is going good, you ate some chicken nuggets. So I walk in, I'm like, hi, I come for a haircut. There was like a bunch of people there. So then she says, hi. Um, however, it would be about an hour wait. Is that fine? I'm like, okay, I don't live far from the haircut place. So I said, yeah, sure, I'll be right back. 7.15 came around, and I come inside. She's like, oh, perfect timing. Like, come come here, I'm ready for you. I'm like, yes, she's ready. Like, this is going to be a fun haircut. Like, I'm excited. And we get to the top. Like, the sides were fine. So once she touches the top, she says, okay, so how do you want me to cut the top? So I tell her, I want you to trim... To trim. I'm like, so I want you to trim very little the top. Like, basically just clean it up. She's like, yeah, for sure, for sure, I got you. So then she does the thing where they comb your hair and then they grab it at the top to see how much they cut it off. And she's like, is this enough? Disclaimer, I am not a hairstylist. So, of course, to me, she grabs like this much of my hair. It's like this much. And I'm like, okay, yeah, like for sure. It didn't seem like a lot. So I said, yeah, I trust you. Um, go ahead. She's like, okay, yeah, we're just gonna clean it up. It's time for the reveal. And she pulls out the mirror. She's like, so how do you like it? And my hair is gone! Like, can I have a crisis? Like, I was bald. So I'm looking at myself like, I didn't know what to say. Like, there's nothing I could do about it. So I'm sitting there. Barbecue sauce on my titties. So then I get up and I pay and I walk out there livid. Like, I'm pissed. So as soon as I get home, I start having a mental crisis. Life hates me. Like, I just want to die. Life freaking hates me! This is not helping right now. It might not seem like a big deal, but with my issues that I have, my hair was getting to the place where I wanted it to be. It was almost there at the point where I was like, yes, I feel confident, like, I look good in my hair. I like my hair for once. And now it's all gone. Like, it's all completely down the drain, and I have to start again from zero. I'm gonna review my haircut at the end of the video, just FYI, so, like, stay for the end. All this week has just been, like, a really rough week because everywhere I look at myself, I just hate myself more and more. So we arrived at the mall. It's time to face my greatest fear of all time and just step into this mall and get new pants, new clothes, whatever I find that's attractive and will make me look better. Though, after a long, long day of shopping, I got my stuff. Why not make a haul? You know, yes, I'm gonna make a haul. So the first thing I got was, first of all, they were on clearance. So they're only five dollars for three pairs of Smurf socks. Like, you know what I mean? Like, look how, look at, look how cute. Take yeah, yeah, mood, mood, like, you know, mood, like, mood. Fun, I guess. So next, from H&M, some, again, some more basic shorts. I don't have any blue basic shorts, so I felt like I needed to. Or because sometimes I don't feel like wearing anything else to school. Sweatpants. You know what I mean? Like, fun. Moving on to American Eagle, I got some pants. So these are the exact same pair, <laughs> except the ones that I have. Let me show you. Hello. <laughs> so new jeans from American Eagle. That's where I buy my jeans at. I haven't found any other place that sells jeans that 
fit me or jeans that I personally like. That's where I get my jeans. I'm wearing an eagle. Okay, so like my favorite shirt that I got, this shirt. What I'm aiming in my style for because I feel like I'm going through a style crisis. So this is what I'm going for. This is what I'm going for. Lastly, from American Eagle, <gasps> I'm kind of excited for this one too. So this like lilac purple, I don't know if it's lilac purple. I feel like I didn't have this color and this color looked really nice on me. So I felt like getting it and I got it. So lastly, I got a Disney pen. There we go. When you're watching a Disney movie, like the first Disney castle that comes up with like the Disney logo. I'm just gonna add it to my pin board of Disney pins. Okay, so where am I gonna put it? Let's see. Yes! 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 It's up here! Oh my god, look at this! I got one more thing because right now this thing is causing a lot of stress in my life and I just needed like good vibes from it. Like I needed good vibes from the mouth. So we headed into the Disney store. And I got my favorite Mickey! Aww. So I applied for the Disney College program, which I hopefully get and I need all of you watching right now to just stop and like send me good vibes. Like I haven't moved on in the process yet, which is kind of stressful and nerve-wracking. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna go into the Disney story and I'm gonna get like something that represents good vibes. So then none other than the mouse himself. And Sorcerer Mickey is my favorite Mickey of all time. I have a little one um, that I got when I when we went to Disneyland as a very as a small kid. But I was like, okay, I need a larger Sorcerer Mickey because he just makes magic. So I'm gonna just so now, it is time for what you all have been waiting for this entire video is me taking this hoodie off because honestly, I'm sweating under this. <sighs> I'm not ready for this. Mm, I don't want to have another mental crisis. I'm kind of scared for this. <laughs> like, you see? You, you see? I'm bald. If you have ever hated one of your haircuts that you got at one point in your life, please comment down below and tell me how you got over it. So as you can see, I have many issues wrong with me. However, we're gonna get through this. I'm just gonna end this video like this with my eyes closed. Give this video a thumbs up if you've ever hated one of your haircuts. Or if you've never hated one of your haircuts, just let me know. Hopefully by next video, my hair has grown back and I'm in a better place. Peace out, Girl Scout.